Well, an extremely generous donation of $50,000 is heading to Feeding America West Michigan. Here's why. Bank of America had a company initiative to help employees get their booster vaccines. For every Bank of America employee in Grand Rapids who got their shot in January, $100 would go to a local hunger relief organization. So the company also made additional contributions to that fund. The money will uh, help Feeding America West Michigan serve, Todd, 200,000 people. Doing good work. Yeah, absolutely. The West Michigan Whitecaps, yes, let's talk baseball. They're gearing up for the season and they're planning to have a ton of fun this summer. Here you go. They've released their promotional schedule. You can find it online. Also, they're kicking off their seven days of deals, which gives fans about 24 hours to purchase tickets for some of the most popular promotions that they have. That'll include some new experiences this year. They're going to have a Marvel's Defenders of the Diamond, where they're going to be playing in superhero-themed jerseys. Uh, of course, fan favorites like Star Wars Night, that's returning this year. Opening day is scheduled for Tuesday, April 12th at LMCU Ballpark. I'm so glad we're talking about baseball. Basketball. How about this one, Todd? Maybe this is more your speed. Parents might want to swim toward this one. Or away. Which, which one is it, Todd? It's, Baby uh, Shark Live yeah. coming to West Michigan. The Splash Tour is making two stops in our area. You can splash along with Baby Shark and Pink Fong at the Wings Event Center in Kalamazoo and then at DeVos Performance Hall in Grand Rapids. Pre-sale tickets for both shows are going on sale later this week. To learn more, just head to babysharklive.com. You know it probably be a sellout. Well, they lost a, they lost an opportunity there. They could have the website should have been babyshark do 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 dot com is what it is what it should have been because the song's now in my head oh. again. Something else we can look forward to this spring: Cedar Point, the amusement park, planning to hire thousands of people for the upcoming season. They're looking to fill about 6,500 seasonal jobs. That's a lot. Who will earn about $1,500, or sorry, $15 per hour, not $1,500. No, I, would, I would be applying if that were the case. Uh, that's for the non-tipped positions, $15 an hour, just so you know. Job opportunities are available in all park operating areas. That's ride operations, servers, security, everything. On-site housing is available for eligible staff members. And the company says they offer discounts, reward programs, free admission to any Cedar Fair Park, and much more. Nice, per nice perks. Cedar Point opens Saturday, May 7th. And U.S. Olympic gold medalist Nick Baumgartner oh. returned to Iron River in the UP Monday to a very warm welcome from his hometown. Here it is. There he is waving. He won gold in mixed snowboard cross after a heartbreaking individual finish just two days earlier. And Crowds line the streets to show their appreciation. You gotta love that hometown, small town, hometown love. Baumgartner is the third athlete from the Upper Peninsula to be a winner <laughs> Olympic gold medals because that's what you do when you are surrounded by snow, like, you know, nine months, ten months out of the year. How cool is that? For him to come back home mm -hmm. to a small town in Michigan holding that medal. Did you medal. did you see his interview? I did not. Uh, okay, I saw the interview after the individual where he didn't get it, and he just wore his heart on his sleeve, talking yeah. about his age. He's, How old is he's he, forty. You know? He's oh, I say because he looked a little bit he's older. 40. But sure. so, so yeah, so he's he's talking. He really he was, he was getting emotional talking about how this probably was his last chance. Sure. And he one little mistake cost him, uh, you know, his medal. And so he was really, really emotional. And then to see that redemption, to see to see that come back was so cool. Cool. So well, cool. Good for Michigan's him. Michigan's proud of you for sure. Hey,